there's 3,000 people standing in my line and nobody's standing in your line. Who's going to hell? To God and the gays. Not me having to recycle outfits. It's because I own exactly one blue piece of clothing that isn't denim. It's this freaking top. There can be a hundred people in the room and 99 won't believe in you, but they're still watching your videos. Who looks like they got black eyes now? What? I'm trying to record here. She's deaf. Well, I'll be right back. I gotta play with my dog. Hey everyone and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Audrey and this is another day of reviewing the slime dolls. And today I'm with Doll with War. We're gonna be reviewing the next one. Well, we would have been reviewing the next one in the ranking, which is Violet, but she's due to release. To release. To arrive to me in February. And that is just no good. So I'm going to review the next one in line, which is also the runner-up. And that is Skylar. The fact that Sunny is just cuter. If Skylar was wearing jeans, she would have been wearing the same jeans I'm wearing today. Muggler. <laughs> um, but she's not. And I can't wait to open her, so let me. Thank you. Oh, here she is in the box. And as you can see, everything is different. I've spoken about the box in my previous videos. So let me go over it very quickly. It's way more glittery than it ever used to be before. I don't like this font. There's a new slogan and it says shine brighter together. The artwork is on the front as well as on the back of the box. And this artwork is meant to cover her feet because she's not wearing her shoes. Her shoes are instead here, making it seem like she comes with way more than she actually does. And her name is actually on the left hand side of the box now. There is a tiny sliver of a window on the right hand side. This is the artwork where you can see all six characters. Poppy is not a part of this line and you can see Ruby, Sunny's and Violet's pet. And the read up down here says, in Rainbow World, your besties customize their fashion and pets with liquid rainbow sparkle slime for a magical one of a kind look. It's immoral, it's wrong, it's bad. You shouldn't put slime in your pets. Here is her barcode if you're looking for her. Let's get her out of this box. Oh, who taped this? I hate the way they tape the new boxes. Oh, excuse me. Her pet's name is Bluebell. Why she complained to MGA saying that it sounds too much like a blue ball? Skylar and every godforsaken thing that she comes with her stand, her comb, her pet, her bag, glitter, this crystal with a packet of slime that she mixed with water, which we're not going to be making, and her shoes. Let's put this bitch aside and let's talk about everything that she comes with. So here we have a regular rainbow high stand, this comb that you can also use as a spoon to mix your slime with her adorable adorable pet blue ball this treacherous bag isn't this the kind of a bag that claude came with her the a rehash of her series one shoes um that now open so you can store slime in them glitter crystal do they even want me to open these slime crystal. Now that we've talked about everything she comes with, let me bring you a little bit closer so we can talk about her and her makeup. As you can see, glitter covers her forehead as well as the bridge of her nose and then it stops. Her makeup is very bald. There is some serious blue eyeliner covered in glitter and on her lower eyelid you can see some like kind of see-through navy denim blue eyeshadow. Um, she's wearing some blush and a lip that I don't necessarily like, but it's kind of complimentary in a way because it's point orange. Um, I like the gradient. I'm not sure on the orange. Her eyes are just the same as they were and her blend is looking very nice. The hair seems to be thick and it is 100% nylon. Her eyebrows are really nice. There is a gradient, they're very bald. That's what her fantastic fashion doll should have had for eyebrows. Let me zoom you back out so we can talk about the outfit. 
here's her outfit and her outfit is a three piece this vinyl jacket that I swear just lost a button um, is not as soft as Michelle's or Junior High Sunny's it's like borderline old Amaya series one but a little bit thinner this top is kind of nice it's giving what's it giving it's not giving magic for sure it's giving 90s men's fashion i'm probably gonna put it on one of the boys because it's kind of giving and this skirt this skirt that is a terribly cut i hate this whose idea was this this is not a good design this would have been so nice had it just not been cut like this. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't like it. The silver paint effect reminds me of the jeans I wear today. Like I mentioned, these are, this is very like Mugler inspired. Like I really wanted, I mean, the skirt has pockets, functional pockets. It's in no way, shape or form bad quality because it has belt loops. It has functional pockets in the front and in the back. And it's, it's just that I hate this. I don't like this. Either make, no, don't make it a mini skirt. Um, but it would have, look, it kind, it would have ate, I think, maybe. I don't know, I don't like Max's skirt. I would have preferred if, if maybe she was wearing jeans. In terms of articulation, she has standard rainbow high articulation. Mine is the wrist joint and the thigh swivel. Let me dress her back up and let me give you my final thoughts. So I've dressed her back up and I did have a little bit of an issue with her jacket. Um, her hands didn't want to cooperate. So if you don't position it just right, um, the sleeves are a little tight. So her thumb is kind of in the way. Um, but at the end, in the end, I did manage to like get it on her. Uh, one more thing, you probably noticed that her feet are turned towards each other and I just want to show you that you can still kind of pose them like this. The only thing you need to be mindful of is um, busting their um, knee joint because you can twist it and you can turn it and it will turn here. If you want to sacrifice it, then um, yeah, definitely go for it. My final thoughts about this doll, she's cute, not gonna lie. However, I like her less than I thought I would. I liked her better in her promo pictures and I liked her better in, in her box. But now that she's unboxed and everything, I'm not vibing with the lips. I think her eyes look kind of weird and I do like her eyebrows. I do like her hair blend and to a degree, I like her, I like two out of three of her clothing pieces. Um, her shoes were never really that special. I love blue ball, not gonna lie. Blue ball is the cutest. What is this even meant to be? A seal? Is this a seal? What is this? Come on now, tell me. Tell me in the comment section down below. What do you think um, blue ball is? What animal do you think blue ball is? I don't really have a lot of thoughts on Skylar. She's, you know, worse than I thought she would be. So I don't know if the ranking is going to change. Um, but so far, I'm not living. But I'm also not disappointed. I mean, of course, I'm disappointed. This is not what Rainbow High used to be, but. I don't know. What does her bag say? Carla Bradshaw. Okay. With the same logo as um, her studio set doll. Kind of, I'm indifferent to her. She's okay, I guess. Um, but she's definitely not the prettiest Skylar. The prettiest Skylar is the studio Skylar. And I will die on that hill. So, yeah. Anywho, this is it. That's all about Skylar. Thank you so much for watching. Do let me know what you think of her. Maybe she's your favorite. Maybe you also feel the same way about her because it's just weird. I was excited to open her and I was like, eh. I think it's the blush and the lips. Maybe if they were gone, maybe if it was more pink, I would have liked it better. They definitely tried to use complementary colors, but I don't think it worked in this particular case. She looks pretty on camera. Like I got to say she looks pretty on camera than she does IRL. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one and that will most definitely be sunny. So thank you so much for watching. Bye. <laughs> I have to laugh. <laughs>